Alrighty, picking up where I left off. Time to go and head hunting. Collect the second radar beacon. So I'll just go here and then go south. Well, they can easily be mistaken. This mistaken? Be mistaken. Yes, you, you, it, it's an illusion, an auditory hallucination. You're hearing shit, Raider. A <laughs> your guy. I exploded it. Noise. I'll take that. I'll take that. And get up there. And I need to see what the fuck I'm doing. Okay, come on. Okay, I'll just go around. Come on, Ada. You can jump, can't you? And there's a fence. Of course there's a fence. I take offense at this fence. All the fence. Searching for a hole in the fence to walk through. Searching. Finally. I'll need to be harder to spot. Or not. Fuck it. All the bullets in this clip for that. Give me that. And you, stop being on fire. Oh, you want to beep? Don't beep at me. Because my little vault boy will laugh at you. Ada, what are you doing way over there? Are you trying to find a hole in the fence too? Oh, you just teleport. Heads up. Here you go, Ada. One slightly dented, but still functional radar beacon. This will do nicely. And, with any luck, it'll help us trace the mechanist's signal. Trace the signal? Really? Remind me how this beacon will get us closer to tracing the mechanist's signal? Each RoboBrain's radar beacon has unique encryption so that it can't be traced back to the source. However, acquiring two additional beacons should provide me with enough data to break the code. So if my theory is correct, mm -hmm. this beacon will help us trace the mechanist's signal. Don't worry. It'll be alright. We'll get Don't there. Worry. I'm sure it'll do the trick. I certainly hope so. I'm going to begin my decryption routine, but it could take a while. In the meantime, I've picked up another RoboBrain beacon signal. It should be the last one you'll need to collect. Yay. Let me guess. This is going to involve a lot of walking. Your astuteness is impressive. If my calculations <laughs> are correct, the signal is coming from... Oh, this isn't good. Location confirmed. The RoboBrain is at Fort Hagen Satellite Array, which means it's in the hands of the Rust Devils. 
Ooh, who are they? Doesn't sound like anything a little lemon juice and some steel wool couldn't fix. It's going to take something a bit stronger to overcome these foes. My old caravan encountered them once while crossing the river into the city. The Rust Devils are a group of <coughs> ruthless raiders who utilize robots for their nefarious practices. They scour the Commonwealth looking for my kind. What they can't capture and reprogram, they strip for spare parts. I realize they pose a greater threat to me than you. I just want you to be well informed. That being said, despite what lies ahead, I can easily continue to decrypt the signal as we proceed. So shall we be on our way? Why, yes, yes, we shall. And it looks like it's just over there. In an area I have not explored yet. Relay tower. Can I activate this relay tower before I get going? I would very much like to. Extend satellites. <coughs> <coughs> okay. I'm waiting. Those aren't satellites, those are dishes. Civil alert found. Distress signal found. <laughs> and I need some rat away. You just go down, Protectron Gollum. Stop shooting me with fire. And that's the last thing that Protectron Gollum will see, is my bullets entering into its corpse. I'll just go up here. Um, never mind. Head. Yep. All the bullets on the head. It's a shame you weren't more headstrong. Hey, give me that loot. Combat sniping rifle. I'll take it. Yeah. Where's the last one? I want to clear this area. You disintegrated him! Well done, Ada. Well done indeed. Top off my bullets and... Where's the uh, console that controls this? It's gotta be up here. All the way at the top. <laughs> Security door control. Open the door. Lookout duty. With all these mechanist bots on the loose, we can't afford to skimp on lookouts. For all we know, the bastard is planning a raid to take all our bots tomorrow. 
No luck, Jaw. This doesn't mean you can set three bots to patrol the area and take a nap. I want at least two living, breathing humans patrolling the perimeter at all times. And let me know immediately if you see any strange bot come up the hill. Okay. Well, I'm not a bot, but I am strange. <clears throat> oh, nice decor. Skulls are a nice touch. You expect me not to see that laser trip wire? Who are you to think you can shoot at me and not die? Now, what did you have on you? Sturdy robot, left arm, chest piece. Yeah, I'll take it, it's mine now. Left leg, chest piece I've got, left arm. <coughs> made it look like a devil. Well, it's it is mine now. Give me them bullets. Anything up here? Hmm, nothing of value. And where does this door open? Okay. Maybe I'll get lucky. Two in a row. And I didn't break the lockpick. Yay. What is this used for? Well, extra tap of the button never hurt. And go over here. Just about. Just a rust devil wearing a clever disguise. Please, don't insult my intelligence. <laughs> just tell me why you're here, and why we're even bothering to have this conversation. Okay, I'll get right to it. Putting down a radar beacon. A radar beacon? How very interesting. That's a very specific part to be searching for, and you don't look like the typical part scavenger type to me. I calculate a 98.8% .8 chance that you're looking for the mechanist. If I'm correct, Good for you. and I usually am, then perhaps we can help each other with our respective predicaments. I'm listening. How refreshing. Then allow me to explain. Now, 
How can I put this as simple as possible so someone at your processing speed can understand? In order to find the mechanist, you're going to need more than just my radar beacon. You're going to need access to the facility. I'm willing to provide said access, but you'll have to fulfill two simple conditions. One, you need to get me as far away as you can from these lunatics. And two, find me a new body. Once both conditions are satisfied, I'll gladly provide you with everything you need. Do we have a deal? Of course. Deal. A wise decision. Once we're at our destination, I'll happily relinquish my radar beacon. It's a very nice view of my character's face. ass. Now, I strongly suggest you stop loitering in the middle of a hostile location and get us both out of here at once. Oh, you flamethrowing Ahab. You go hunt your Just white whale. Well, come on. Let's not wait around for more horrifying monstrosities. Now, in here, there is a nice little toy that I can acquire. I just don't remember where it is. Hmm. I need to go up and then across. Watch the trip wires. I'd rather keep myself intact today, thank you. <laughs> Watch it, you Claude. I'm not going that way just yet. Scanning for hostile perimeter movement detected. Possible stealth unit in the AO. Okay, this is where No, this is not where <laughs> I need to drop some stuff. Actually, I'll just go ahead and level up strength. That'll give me some more carrying weight capacity. 350. through that door or do I need to I'll take that thank you ooh I'll take those Neato. Got it.
Oops. <clears throat> 10,850. Yes, I want to quit the game. That's why I said quit. I'm ejecting the holotape. I'm taking it with me. It's mine now. <clears throat> You really are taking the path of most resistance here, aren't you? Yes, yes I am. For a reason. I turned him into bits. Start your robot right Come and get me. Oh, I didn't mean like that. Jeez. <laughs> that gun turret and it's exploding bullets. A 34% probability to hit. And it's dead. And you get repaired. We may have an enemy nearby. And I'm going to check my inventory. Wow. Check my apparel. Heavy combat armor. Robot left arm, leg, and right leg. Okay. Drop that. Right arm. Left arm, left and right leg, chest piece, good. I've got all the necessary pieces to make a robot armor. I don't need to pick up any more. Now, if it's not in here, then where is that weapon I'm looking for?
Okay, those are disarmed. I'm good to go up here. Oh, another computer terminal. Time to break in. Riches. Likeness of one. So... It's the one with the S in it. Sweet. Well, thank you, Ada. That really is nice of you to say. Check up here. Bullets. Mine. Based on my limited experience with you, I estimate a 65% chance of making it out of here. Not optimal. An increase in effort could have an impact on the odds. Of course. This is the one that ripped my head off. I demand we rip her head off. It's only fair. Wasn't that wonderful? Engaging. <laughs> Ivy, stop it. Just die. I want to take that Head weapon I've got. I would have killed her myself. Oh well. Six of one, half dozen of the other. Tesla Good job, 60. Human. Nice. Tesla rifle, that's what I've been looking for. Can't wait to upgrade you. <clears throat> Saltron helmet. No. Don't need... Thank you very much. And... Bingo! <laughs> Fat man? Many nukes are mine! Batman, I'll take it. Sixty percent probability of making it out. Oh, Jezebel, you silly little thing. Jezebel and Ada, up we go. Thank goodness we are out of that hole. Don't think your job is done. I refuse to cooperate until you provide a body that meets my standards. Good for you, Jezebel. Heads Good up. for you. Here you go, Ada. The final radar beacon. I'll need that head back when you're done. Of course. Shouldn't take but a moment. There you go. Still in one piece. I'm not sure why you want the head back. All we needed was its radar beacon. Besides, robo-brains are notorious for being... Well, a real pain in the neck. 
Does that mean we're ready to finally track down the mechanist? Now that you have the final radar beacon, will it be enough to track down the mechanist's location? I certainly hope so. I've already started the calculations while we've been having this conversation. That still doesn't explain why you need that head back. Uh, well, <laughs> we still need it. We still need it, Ada. I believe it can help us access the mechanist's facility. Of course. It makes perfect sense that the mechanist would not only keep its location a closely guarded secret, but would secure it against intrusion as well. I'm terribly sorry. I hadn't considered that possibility at all. I'm afraid when it comes to That's fine. You've been calculating other things. When I say that. Why would you say something like that? Isn't it obvious? Ever since I let my friends die in that caravan, I feel like I've been failing in my duties. I chose the route we took the day we were attacked. Perhaps if I had selected an alternate route, they'd still be alive. Sometimes I wish that Jackson had programmed me with my personality mode set permanently to disable. Personality mode? But you're an individual! Your personality defines you as an individual. Never let that go. You're right. All of the good memories I've experienced being Ada would be lost if my personality mode was shut down. I can't afford to lose them. I really think I needed to hear that from someone else. Thank you. Now I've distracted ah, you're you for welcome. long enough. I'll finish up my calculations while you deal with our new friend, Jezebel. Hopefully, she'll be able to grant us access to the Mechanist's facility and we can put an end to this nonsense once and for all. Alrighty. Build Jezebel a body. That I will be doing next time. Thank you for watching if you got this far. Hope you enjoyed. I know I had fun and enjoyed. Well, I hope you did too. With both. Having fun and enjoying. Bye.